So what's up guys, it's Matty the Nerf Guy here, uh, broadcasting live from the Matty Lair. Welcome to another loadout video. Um, we'll go ahead and pop right into this thing. Um, I'm running for this loadout a, my, as my primary, my and my modded Recon CS6, though I like to more call this thing a modded Recon uh, CS35 because of the uh, 35 guard drum here. Um, so anyway, this thing has more of a powerful kick to it. And, um, I had a friend who actually modded this thing over. It's got a larger plunger than the original uh, Recon. It's got a, I guess it's got a better spring in it. And all, I'm not sure. Um, I bought this one from uh, from my friend on a Facebook group called uh, Nerf Buy Sell and Trade. And all, um, the way you can get to that is a uh, www slash uh, dot facebook dot com forward slash groups forward slash uh, Nerf Buy Sell Trade. Um, so yeah. Anyway, um, so this is my primary for this thing. It's got a really good punch, holds 35 darts and all. Um, also, if I wanted to, I could hold a 6 dart magazine here and then hold one spear dart right there. Um, but this will just be uh, for this thing. I, I'm just carrying this because it is. It, this is the most capacity you can get in a 35 dart drum, and I'm not really a fan of the Boomco blasters and all. You know, even though Boomco does hold, though I think their maximum clips I think go up to like 40. I think. Or there's one that kind of like that holds, I guess, up to 72, I think, you know. Um, I'm not a big fan of that because of how fast, you know, it goes through ammunition. So, me, I'll just be, I'd just be using this and all, um, because it holds 35 darts. You know, there's really no need for reloading, for reloading and all. Um, for me, I'm, this is more of a support, a support role. Um, I'm not gonna, I wouldn't be doing slam fire in this thing. I would simply more likely just be, uh, you know, just pulling back and firing. The whole purpose of this loadout is to be as light as possible, yet have as much firepower as you possibly can in the support loadout. Normally, I'm going heavy in my support loadout, and I'll, um, so yeah, um, this, so this is my primary, my modded, uh, Recon CS, uh, 6. So, for my backup here, I'm running a rough cut, a, uh, um, I guess you could call it the, uh, um, I don't know what color scheme this is, and all of it's, you know, I know it's just the play new paint paint scheme and all but I used to have a blue rough cup with that one broke and all but so I got this one for Christmas I believe in 2014 so yeah um this thing is really cool because I mean eight shots you know if I run out of if I run out of am ammunition you know for that one I can just pull this one out of my back out of the back of my uh, thing here where I'll be holding this you know um this, it fits really really nicely in there um sorry sorry there's something in the way there ah there it is so it's not want to cooperate. Anyway, there we go. Um, but I, I like holding it in the uh, back there. Sorry guys, this is an airsoft vest, not a nerf vest. And all um, I don't really have access to any nerf vest, so I bought an airsoft vest. And all, so yeah. Um, also in this airsoft vest, I will pull. I will um, carry like you know, just carry extra darts. You know um. That's what I like about this thing. It's got several, several pockets right here where I can carry extra darts and all. Um, I, so I'm just running this thing on the key side to carry, like, let's say, you know, accessories or whatever and all. Um, I'm probably going to be using this pocket right here to carry extra darts. And, and my last resort blaster for this loadout is... Um, and my last resort blaster is the Night Finder. The Night Finder is basically a single-shot front-loading blaster. Um... Well, uh, where's my thing here and all, um, ah, here it is. I like this one just because, you know, I mean, it can hold, it, I just like every other thing, um, this one will be used as my last resort blaster, it'll always be primed, um, so that when I'm using my recon, I'll have this thing in my gorilla tactical holster, you know, this thing will only have its actual three darts, and all, I know that's kind of bad and all, but, um, the reason being that this one would have it only three darts is because, I mean, it's a last resort blaster, and I mean, any dart, granted at anything, like if you had a game of HVZ or any, you know, any, uh, like an NIC war or a Sambo game or whatever, you know, um, there's gonna be darts on the ground that you can use to fire from this thing, so I'd probably be using darts that are on the ground and using this to, uh, you know, to fire off that one that's a little weak, sorry, um, so yeah, this one's going to be my last resort blaster when, like, you know, I run out of, out of darts for my, um, for my primary and uh, my secondary and all, then that's when I'll run this thing. You know, um, I'll probably use this thing for the remainder of the war. You know, um, so yeah. Um, this has been my loadout for 
I'm not. This is just you know. Um, there's pretty much just another support. Uh, another loadout. I'm call. This is my. Uh, what is it? My light support loadout. Um, it just focuses on uh, you know ca carrying something light like the recon, but carrying is um, but um, carrying as many shots with you as possible. You know, um, that's why 35 do drum. You know, and only firing when advantageous to you or. You know, or when just supporting your team. So, you don't, won't get a ton of tags with this loadout, but you do get to help your team complete the game objectives and all. Um, I'll see you guys tomorrow with a with um, a surprise review video. So, peace and hair grease, guys. Much love. Peace out.